Okay, I'm gonna click on it. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> What's up? My name is Avery and today is the start of a weekend weekly reading vlog. I don't know. <laughs> so today is August 15th and I just ended my summer session two classes. Yay me. <laughs> I actually didn't just finish it. Also sorry for Oreo's tail batting in the wind. I ended this morning. Um, my final was at 8am so um, I finished earlier today, but I took like a chill day. Like I didn't even go to the <gasps> back to what I was talking about before. I was rudely interrupted. I didn't even go to the gym today. I literally just sat in my bed, did some diamond painting, and watched Say Yes to the Dress, and went and saw a movie at the movie theaters with my best friend. That's basically all I did today. <laughs> I haven't had a day like that in so long though, so. So I have a whole 10 days off until I have to take some fall classes at the community college to be able to get into the main university that I'm planning to go to in the spring. They're making me take some fall classes at my community college. I just have 10 days of not going to school, so <laughs> um, I thought I would spend those 10 days reading as much as possible. Um, I honestly don't know how it's going to work. I haven't physically read a book in a while that wasn't a graphic novel so we'll see how this goes i really wanted to post another reading vlog i've been in a reading vlog mood so why not we'll see what happens <laughs> and how much footage i get but i do know that sunday and monday i will be busy probably not vlogging because i'm helping my sister move into her college dorm i'm gonna be a little busy later on the weekend but other than that I'm real happy that I don't have school for 10 days. <laughs> but anyway, I thought I'd let you know what I'm currently reading. So I really wanted to finish the Saga graphic novel series. Right now I'm currently listening to Lover Revealed, I'm pretty sure that's the name of it. There's so many J.R. Ward books in this series, but I have been introduced to J.R. Ward. <laughs> so I picked up Dark Lover, the first book in this series, like months ago, maybe like two months ago. I bought the uh, mass market paperback from Barnes and Noble one day on a whim. I read maybe halfway and was like, you know what? Like, I'm not really feeling it right now. And I think I put it down for something I was more intrigued by. Um, like I thought it was an okay book at the time, but then I got the Audible Romance package and they have maybe all, I don't know, of all of the Black Dagger Brotherhood series. They for sure have the first four because this is the fourth one I'm listening to. They have all of those on the Audible Romance package. So I saw, I saw Dark Lover on there and I was like, you know what? I'll try this out. I'm obsessed. They're so good. Oh my gosh. If you didn't know what the Black Dagger Brotherhood series is, it is urban fantasy romance series about vampires. And like, you think it's like companion novels about a vampire and their love interest after each book, but like, it's all told in third person. So you get the perspective of literally everybody in the series, not just the two love interests. So you see like, people growing from book one to book like four and they still haven't had their own book yet so like it's pretty freaking cool and i have around four and a half hours left of the audiobook i really want to finish it because <laughs> it's at like the climax right now so i need to know what's going on and then for sure once i finish that i'm gonna be picking up the next one i'm just gonna be flying through these books i I'm, I'm, I'm loving them. I really want to own the collection now. <laughs> but anyway, as for physical reads, I have the Lovely Ladies Book Club pick for the month of August, which is Waiting for Tom Hanks, by, I think by Carrie Winfrey. That's a rom-com book. I'm honestly really tired and it's only 10.30. I'm normally a night owl, but with school, I've, I'm going to bed before 11 o'clock and that hasn't happened since like freshman year of high school. So I'm actually real tired. So I may just like maybe read a chapter and go to bed. I may just listen to my audiobook and play a game on my phone. We'll see, but I will update you in the morning for sure.
just pulled into um, my gym because I'm trying to go to the gym every day. Yesterday was my uh, one day off I've had in a long time. Well, let's update you on my reading. I have less than one hour left in my Lover Revealed audiobook and it just left off on such a sad part and I am really sad. Each book is about like a couple and like you know who's like end game. I'm like, you kind of know who's Endgame in this book, but like, there's also like a guy in the picture. I honestly don't know who I want Butch to be with more. <laughs> Cause like, there's so much sexual tension between him and this guy. I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> honestly, I would be for it though, so. <laughs> but anyway, I gotta go on the treadmill right now and I'm gonna watch some booktube. I love to catch up on booktube while I'm on the treadmill even though I have not caught up on any booktube because it's been like what a month since I've like consecutively watched booktube videos so my watch later playlist is literally over 350 videos like it's ridiculous <laughs> and like I maybe make a little bit of a dent in it one day and then the next day everyone posts new videos so like Y'all need to stop posting videos so I can watch your old ones. So I didn't update you after um, going to the gym yesterday. And I ended up finishing Lover Revealed by J.R. Ward on the way home from the gym. So yeah, I think I'm going to give that four out of five stars. I really enjoyed it. I am loving the Black Tiger Brotherhood so much right now. I'm really obsessed. Um, I just downloaded the fifth book. So I'm going to start listening to that soon. But... It is saga time. I'm gonna be reading some saga. To be honest with you, I'm really tired, so I really hope I don't fall asleep while reading. <laughs> I just, I, I just finished vol, 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 volume nine. I think I died inside. <gasps> Oh my god! So, uh, it's been a couple hours, maybe like two hours, and I already finished seven, eight, and nine. The ending to this book. There's no volume ten yet. <laughs> I am really sad. People died in here that shouldn't have died. I hope it's all fake and the people who died in this didn't actually die because that would suck so much. This series, wow, if you want to go on an emotional roller coaster and read these books. Hi there everybody, it's been a while, it's been actually a couple of days. Today is Monday night, it's just about to hit midnight. First off, before I talk in this clip, I just want to say sorry for the unmade messy bed. Uh, this booger behind me decided to puke on my bed when I came home from my trip today. <laughs> anyway, I was out of town because I helped my sister move into her dorm room for the past two days. I actually read a bunch. I ended up accidentally leaving my um, headphones at home. So I was not able to watch the booktube or the Say Yes to the Dress episode I wanted to or listen to my um, J.R. Ward audiobook. <laughs> so I ended up reading up to around 50% of The Swedish Prince. I'm really enjoying it so far. It's a little bit too insta-lovey for my taste right now. They've only known each other for maybe like a week and he is getting real attached, just gotta say. Other than that, I'm really enjoying it. That's all the reading that I got done in the past couple days. Oh, and today has been a huge day. A couple days ago, Jess from Peace Love Books, I love her channel by the way, I'll link her down below. Um, she is a great romance channel. She like shouted me out on Twitter and I freaked the F out because she's like a popular booktuber and like I love her videos and I was like freaking out because I've never like seen like a popular booktuber like notice me before, you know what I mean? It's real weird and exciting and I'm very grateful. I come home today from helping my sister move into her dorm with my mom and I like plug my phone into my charger in my room and I don't look at it for a couple of hours because I go eat dinner. I'm applying to go to the same school my sister is at so I was in the middle of doing the application process and I was watching Bachelor in Paradise with my mom and dad. And so I didn't look at my phone for a couple of hours and so at like 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 
I go look at my phone because I need to like get some information off it or something. I immediately get a notification that uh, Riley Marie subscribed to my YouTube channel. And I literally started screaming and running around my living room. And my mom looked at me like I was crazy. This is an insane feeling. She's like one of my top three favorite booktubers. The reason why Riley found out about my channel, apparently, because I tweeted her saying like, thank you so, so much. And she was like, oh yeah, I found out about your channel because Jess mentioned you in her recent video. And I was like, what? <laughs> so it turns out Jess also shouted me out in a booktube video. <laughs> this is insane. I woke up this morning with maybe like 950 subs and it's, it's almost at a thousand. I'm at 980 right now. This is insane. This is insane. And I'm so grateful. So thank you anybody who watches my videos. This is like insane. I never expected 10, let alone a thousand people to watch my YouTube videos, like at all. I didn't think people would want to watch my content to be honest with you because I, I read a weird range of books. <laughs> I didn't think anybody would like the same books that I did, but um, I'm wrong, obviously. So. Uh, today's been crazy it's been stress-filled like this is such a great pick-me-up though because for the past couple days of me helping my sister move into her dorm my anxiety my, my anxiety was through the roof like I'm so anxious that like you, you can't really tell right now but this whole part of my cheek is bruised because absent-mindedly because of the social anxiety and being around so many people and the college environment like I started picking my face and bruised my face up um, without me realizing that I was doing it until my dad was like, uh, what's on your face? I guess I, I, I ruined it because of this environment that I was in. But like this whole experience today and lovely, amazing booktubers have just made me feel so much, so much better. <laughs> so thank you all. Hey y'all, it's the next day. I am in my gym's parking lot. I'm gonna go work out. And watch some booktube while I work out. I'm a real beat, y'all. I stayed up till like 3 a.m. watching YouTube because I have been YouTube depre deprecated. Is that the right word? Deprecated for um, like a month. So I was. I have like over 300 videos in my watch later playlist. So I spent a lot of time yesterday watching YouTube after I came home. So I'm gonna go watch some more. Oh my gosh, it's pouring. Okay, I'm gonna click on it. <gasps> oh my god! What'd you get? I'm at already 1,020! It is not even two hours later and it's already at a thousand twenty. Hey y'all, it's the next day. Sorry I didn't like follow that last clip up with anything. I was in shock. <laughs> Basically, sorry, I'm throwing the ball to the dogs. You want it? Come get it. <laughs> I just wanted to say like thank y'all so so much this is literally insane I'm just like very eternally grateful for anybody watching any of my videos this is crazy and I'm so 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 grateful for all of you I love all of you so much thank you from the bottom of my heart yeah I'm gonna get to some reading um I really hope I can maybe crossing my fingers finish this today even though I'm on page five it only has 200 something pages in it so I think I can do it I really don't want it to be in like a time crunch before the live show I believe the live show is on um, August 31st if I'm not mistaken or the September 1st whichever one is a Saturday we're doing it on a Saturday Jen has already read it and she loved it Ashley's halfway through so I need to get into it as well. So that's what I'm going to be doing for the next couple of hours. If you can guess what two characters are on this bookmark, I will forever be your friend.
Okay, I have to go inside. The mosquitoes are freaking eating me alive. Hey y'all, it is later in the day. It's just about to be midnight and I thought I would wrap up this vlog. I am 94 pages into Waiting for Tom Hanks by Carrie Winfrey. I am actually really loving this. I've already tabbed like all these blue tabs are scenes that like I've laughed out loud for. Some great one-liners. I've been loving her writing. Like I'm flying through this book. I'm really excited and if you want to discuss this book with us be sure to tune in to my channel on August 31st. I was about to say September. It's August. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really, really, really enjoying this and I cannot wait to finish it. I also this week completed 50% of The Swedish Prince by Karina Holly. It's a really quick read and I'm really enjoying it. The only thing I'm just liking is how insta-lovey it is. They become like infatuated with each other like the moment they see each other and I'm more of the angsty kind of romance reader if you know what I mean. The only time that I really enjoy insta-love kind of or that like instant connection you know what I mean is when it's like a faded mate situation in like paranormal romance books that's when like I swoon for some reason <laughs> and then I also read volumes seven eight and nine of saga I believe I gave volume seven five stars volume eight four stars and volume nine five stars of volume nine wrecked me and i'm really sad that i will not know what is going to happen for a long time <laughs> again thank y'all so 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 much for helping me hit a thousand subscribers like this is crazy please let me know down below if you've read any of the books that i mentioned in this video or if you plan to thank y'all so so much for watching and i'll see y'all soon with a new video bye